Hi, good morning, Girl Boss Beauties. I am back with another beauty related video. I am on a roll and expected to continue because I've been doing a little shopping. So, in today's video, I'm going to show you guys what I got from both Ulta and Sephora when I went in to pick up my birthday gifts. So, both Ulta and Sephora have rewards or memberships that you can join and based on how much you spend, they'll give you little birthday gifts, they'll give you perks throughout the year. So I first went into Ulta and I will show you what I got. Um, so for one of my birthday gifts from Ulta, they gave me this birthday kisses from Ulta Beauty Collection and it includes a lip mask as well as a juice infused lip oil. So the um, shades are the, yeah, the shade is cranberry plus pomegranate. So this is the lip mask, the cranberry and pomegranate mask. And then this is what the lip oil looks like. So I will be using this, especially when I mask the rest of my face, I could see myself using that. So I thought that was really cute. They also gave me the It Cosmetics Superhero Elastic Stretch Volumizing Mascara. I'm really excited to use this because I previously used the superhero mascara and I loved it. I love a volumizing mascara. I like my lashes to be a little bit more plump because I don't wear lashes on a daily basis since I'm in the office and I try to keep it a little bit professional. Um, and so it just says, happy birthday, you deserve it. Hashtag real superhero there, which I like. They also gave me a NARS orgasm blush which I thought was super cute. It says, happy birthday, just what you wished for. And I love the rose gold box. I, I love rose gold, such an addiction. But I've never tried NARS's orgasm. Um, I heard that it wasn't really good for brown skin. So now I get to try it out with out buying it and I love it. I love this size because it's perfect to go into my cosmetics case that stays in my um, work bag. I also have one of these from last year and Sephora gave them out and they were in like these very specific shades that no one else could get from Sephora. They were very exclusive. So that's not what Ulta did. They gave out the best selling um, NARS blush shade, which is orgasm. Let's see. Okay, so those are all the things that I got for free. Also, I got $10 off for my birthday month when I made a purchase. So what you'll see here, I got $10 off. I got double points. And I think that's it. Oh, and on these purchases, I also had points, which at Ulta converts to dollars off your future purchases. So I got an additional $8 off. So the items I'm going to show you here cost $18 in total less than they would have if I had purchased them anywhere else. Now, I got for my kind of makeup cosmetics bag this NYX Contour Intuitive Palette. I like this. It feels Girl Boss Beauty approved to me. One, I like NYX shadows. Two, they give you six shadows. As you can see here, you get a highlighter. Um, you actually get two highlighters and you get a blush. So I feel like this is perfect for the girl on the go. I will test it out and let you know. But right now, this was $4.99. So it was 75% off. You why, why not try it at that price point? And I want to say that in honor of me doing this video today, I tried for the first time, the palette that Ulta gave out last year for the birthday gift. Look, I still have the plastic on the mirror, but um, this is the palette that they gave out last year. And I used it today to do my eye makeup. And I really like how it came out, you know, it, and it's something very different for me in the office. I haven't really been wearing eyeshadow a lot, 
So then I also picked up the Clinique Beyond Perfecting Foundation and Concealer. This is a foundation and I got it in the shade 24 Golden. It was the last black girl friendly shade um, that they had because this was on clearance. Um, they are not, Ulta is going to stop carrying Clinique makeup. They will continue to carry their skincare though. So this was um, $15 because it was 50% off this $29. So I'll do a review on this. And luckily it looks like it was my shade. And lastly, I was so excited because I got the Urban Decay Born to Run palette. This Born to Run palette it says, for the adventurer, the road warrior, or the weekend escapist, no matter where you're going or what you're going, what you're getting up to, Born to Run is the only palette you need to pack and never look back. And that is why I bought it. And as soon as I saw it, that's what I thought. So this is what the packaging looks like. And it's just all these little Instagram pictures. You guys, whoo, the mirror is substantial. Substantial. Oh my gosh. This is what it looks like. I don't want to blind you. Yeah, this is what it looks like. And these are the shades. I have heard nothing, nothing but outstanding things about this palette. I cannot wait to use it. I love Urban Decay shadows. I love the brand Urban Decay. It's one of my first um high-end makeup brands I ever used. Actually, one of the first makeup brands I ever became accustomed to using. And it has every shade. It has the blues, the greens, the purples, the oranges. It has all the dark shades that we need. I just, I'm so excited to use that. So that is what I got from Ulta. And my total came out to be about 40 eight dollars for all of the items that I just showed you there so then I went to uh, Sephora I had a gift card for my birthday so I went ahead and went into Sephora to see what I could pick up and I needed a new eyebrow oh I'll start with the free stuff well the birthday gift first so this year the birthday gift you had two choices I got the glam glow set because glam glow is one of my favorite skincare brands but it is expenses no it's very expensive i'm just kidding um but it's very expensive so you got a super mud clearing treatment as well as the glow starter mega illuminating moisturizer i have had samples of both i've used the full size of the super mud so i know that it's excellent which is why i got it um i also had like 12 to 1300 points in sephora sephora's points do not convert to money they just give you samples of products so I picked up the fresh sample this was 250 points it's the fresh vitamin nectar moisture glow face cream and the sugar lip treatment so I picked that up I also picked up a fresh Lotus Youth Preserve Face Cream with Super 7 Complex. I keep using these little samples, but I know I love this. I, at some point, I may just buy the full size. All right, so those were my free things. And then I'll show you what I purchased. I got the Precisely My Brow um, Benefit Pencil in shade 4. I don't know why I didn't pick this up from Ulta. But I, did, I wasn't thinking about it. I, I should have just bought this from Ulta. But this is the shade 4. It's my favorite brow pencil. Didn't use it today because I'm out. I also got a NARS Velvet Lip Glide. I could have also purchased this at Ulta. But it's in the shade Bound. Oh, I did look for this at Ulta and they didn't have this shade. But I absolutely love this. And I'm going to use this today, which is why I'm doing this video. It's in the shade Bound. Um, I picked up something from Pat McGrath. So Pat McGrath came out with these glittering uh, lip fetish lip balms. They are hella expensive. You can only get it on her website or, or from Sephora. And I picked it up. But you guys, look at this package. It's 
is not everything. Oh my gosh, it is so dope. I got the shade Bronze and it comes up like this. So I'm going to also use this today. We'll, we'll see. I want to put this on top of Bound. That's my idea. And I also picked up a new Dior foundation, which um, if you guys know, you remember I was addicted to a Dior foundation back when I first started my channel in like 2017. And um, they discontinued it. So they replaced it with something else that I didn't like. And now they've come out with the Dior Backstage, which sounds a lot like what I was using previously, except this is for face and body. It says extreme condition proof. Um, I would say that includes Houston, Texas. So I'm going to give this one a try as well. And yeah, so that is what I got. So let me put my... I'm going to try this NARS blush i'm gonna use my sephora pro angle blush brush so i'm using the orgasm try to be in frame for this so i don't know it looks very it looks very muted on me And I'm just stamping it on, really. It, it looks more glittery than anything. It is more like glittery than I expected. But this is what we're going with. This is what we're going with. And now for the lippies, let me use this bound gloss. Let me see if this works. And this really isn't a gloss. It's not the right term. It, they call it the velvet lip glides. They are the best cream lipstick gloss mixture that I've ever found. And I thought this shade was so unique. I've used at least five different samples of this shade. <laughs> and I'm just now buying the real thing. So that's what it looks like. All y'all naturalistas, do you just randomly fluff your hair sometimes? Because that's clearly what I'm doing right now. I heard you cannot twist it up so high because it could break so this is what it looks like on my skin I don't know I tried does it look any different you're gonna be like no nah, girl it's a lip balm <laughs> anyway these are the items that I got from Ulta and Sephora of course I think you can tell that I have an affinity for Ulta um, a little more than Sephora, but that's no surprise given one of the videos that I did at the end of last year talking about my difference with their membership programs. I will link that below, but let me know what you've been getting at Ulta instead of going into Sephora for, and let me know why you're still going to Sephora. If you want me to do a full review of any of these, let me know. What I'm most excited about is definitely the Pat McGrath lip um, balm, which I think is a balm idea. Balm idea. And then this, hunty, this, everything. So with that being said, have a great day, Girl Boss Beauties. I'm headed into the office. It is 8.15 on the dot. So I'll get in the office around 8.30. Um, be blessed to be a blessing. Go get it. Hashtag level up. Bye.